Frances Ellen Watkins Harper, born in Baltimore, lived 1825 through 1911. Writer, poet, considered the mother of African-American journalism. Suffragette, abolitionist, assisting on the Underground Railway. Composer of this poem, which seems as relevant today as it did back then, and just as necessary. Shall we carry it with us as our song? So that maybe one day we don't have to sing songs like this. Until then, Songs for the People by Frances Ellen Watkins Harper. Let me make songs for the people, songs for the old and young, songs to stir like a battle cry wherever they are sung. Not for the clashing of sabers for carnage, nor for strife, but songs to thrill the hearts of men with more abundant life. Let me make the songs for the weary amid life's fever and fret, till hearts shall relax their tension and careworn brows forget. Let me sing songs for little children before their footsteps stray, sweet anthems of love and duty to float o'er life's highway. I would sing for the poor and aged where shadows dim their sight, of the bright and restful mansions where there shall be no night. Our world so worn and weary needs music, pure and strong, to hush the jangle and discords of sorrow, pain, and wrong. Music to soothe all its sorrow, till war and crime shall cease, and the hearts of men grown tender, girdle the world with peace. Songs for the People by Frances Ellen Watkins Harper. Let's make it our song. See you tomorrow.